Well, hope you're doing well on this Monday. Um, Lee Harder, TND here with some, some of your early week headlines. Uh, interesting story today. Um, Power Plant SC, uh, catchy name for an effort that's going to take place on Earth Day, April 22nd, where the groups, including Boy Scouts and others, particularly Boy Scouts in our area and Black, I think in many other areas, but all around South Carolina, the effort is going to be to plant the most trees ever in one single day. Uh, these folks are gonna be planting loblolly pines in yards and other places. Uh, one of it is designed also to help long-term with flood control, et cetera. Uh, also today you'll read about how uh, the Department of Agriculture is encour encouraging specialty crop purchases and availability from uh, South Carolina specialty crop farmers, uh, notably strawberries, uh, but in, yeah, obviously the effort is to buy South Carolina. Um, you'll read today where there are 13 uh, new cases of coronavirus found in Orangeburg County. Uh, the Masters ended with a historic win by Hideki Matsuyama, uh, the first Japanese golfer to ever win a major, and includes obviously the Masters. Uh, baseball, South Carolina uh, took down Mizzou yesterday to win their series. Clemson dropped the game to Virginia to lose that series. Uh, check out today's editorial and um, consider nominating a veteran for our Stories of Honor uh, series, which begins soon. Uh, we are in looking for some more nominees, uh, and they are out there, those who have served our country uh, in the military. Uh, read today in, in the Farm Report about a Carolina Clear, uh, an effort that uh, is doing a lot to improve water quality in South Carolina. And I want to add, tell you again about my editor's offer, uh, $29.99 for the website for a year. Uh, that puts you in touch with local news and a whole lot more. Uh, check us out under um, the uh, Become a Member up at the top of our homepage. Uh, you can always contact me directly and I'll connect you. Um, my email address, uh, L Harder, H-A-R-T-E-R, at Times and Democrats spelled out dot com. Uh, I hope you have a great Monday.